The global manufacturing industry is gradually adopting smart technology into the manufacturing process. This helps the system and the entire supply chain to work timely and efficiently to handle unexpected emergency. While global demand changes rapidly, how does Taiwan's machine tool industry provide the best product and solutions to clients all over the world? Hey guys, this is May. You are watching Taiwan Insight. This is a show that will be going on site to explore various industry in Taiwan. In each episode, we'll introduce a different industry through local insights and global perspective for you to stay on top of every business opportunity. Today, for the very first episode, we'll introduce you the machine tool industry, aka the mother of machinery. So, what's so good about Taiwan? Well, Taiwan's machine tool industry holds 5 to 6% of the global market share and has a complete supply chain system from R&D, design to component processing manufacturing for assembling, testing, and finally, sales and after sales services. What's more, Taiwan's machine tool products are a good value for the money and far more competitive than other brands. Our influence is so powerful in the international market that our applications range from automotive, aerospace, rail transport, electronics, molds, and the manufacturing of various mechanical parts. It's everywhere around the world. Agile is another strength of Taiwan's machine tool manufacturers. They provide solutions to help their clients on efficiency, quality, and cost reduction. With birth rates declining and labor costs increasing, demands for digital, automated, and smart equipment will not disappear, but only continue to grow. As industry around the world are moving towards smart manufacturing, new applications in big data, 5G, IoT, and automated peripherals will continue to innovate. Okay, enough of talking. Let me show you some amazing manufacturing products. Let's go to the cluster of machine tools, Taizhong. Task其实是一个智能化的载体，那你既可以做IOT的机联网，那数款的APP会摆你各种客户的需求，可以去做一个搭配的选用，有点像我们手机的的APP的道理，其实是一样的。我们的主轴就是有两大主轴，那第一大
后领刀功能点具可以看到，我们有可以依工单做领刀，然后依刀具的类型做领刀，跟一般的领刀。那我们这边先看一下一般领刀的话，它会秀出刀具的图片来避免人员的领用错误。在这边可以点选，就很像是网购一样，上面还有购物车可以确认你点选的清单。这是我们刀具柜智慧仓储系统内部的结构。这边可以看到我们有一个掉落 sensor， 它会去做掉落数量的那个计数这样子。然后并且这个 count 的数据都会及时的回写到上面我们的。工业电脑里面的资料库，帮客户产生及时的报表。来看一下我们的报表功能，我们的智慧仓储系统有一些报表的及时报表的自动产出。那这边可以看到，包含我们的库存盘点、出入库明细，然后领刀明细，跟我们的低库存通知，还有采购建议。那这个报表我们可以直接透过网路传送给客户的供应商。让他们可以直接做刀具的采买跟补货。Now that we learn a little about these manufacturers, let's talk about ESG and whether Taiwan's manufacturers can meet your demand on building a green supply chain. Net zero carbon emissions continues to be a worldwide hot topic, and as carbon taxes roll out, Taiwanese manufacturers have started developing green machine tools. For example, to reduce the usage of traditional cooling equipment that cause high energy consumptions. Steps will be taken to limit material that overly depend on refrigeration technology, and use heat convection to achieve heat equilibrium. So, after all the information of Taiwanese manufacturers who provide high-quality machine tools, you may wonder how can I meet them? Well, here's the very good news: this year in 2022, for the first time, we will have Tintos and TMTS, the two major machine tools, combined together. Over 900 companies will attend this impressive exhibition at the Taipei Nangan Exhibition Center from February 21st to 26th. The exhibition will cover dozens of online services and activities. No need to go abroad. We have on-site guide for online visitors, live tour of the exhibition, and online matchmaking meetings, which helps you to find a good Taiwanese supplier. Hit the link below and sign up for the event. For highlights and more up-to-date info, please check out our website and fan page. Okay, that's all for today. I hope you learn more about Taiwan's machine tool industry. On the next episode, we'll bring you to the bicycle industry in Taiwan. If you don't want to miss out our first-hand news, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video to all of your friends. This is Taiwan Insight. See you next time.